Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we have another Is This Pistol Still Relevant video. And I'm enjoying this series, I get great feedback and I enjoy each and every comment that I read when I feature a handgun and ask the question, is this pistol still relevant? Well today we have a good one, but last time, and it's been a while, we featured the Ruger Security 9 Compact. Now the Compact is the 3.4 inch barrel model with 10 round mags. And that is the reason why I asked the question, is this pistol still relevant? And primarily because it has 10 round mags. With a handgun this size, is it outdated? Considering all the newer handguns out there, the subcompact, double stack mag, 9mm, here's a P365, you look at the difference in size and length of the slide, and then we look at the width of the grip. For CCW purposes, is this pistol still relevant? And I got some great feedback as always. People said, yes, it's relevant, but I would choose something else. Now, this is budget priced, 369 MSRP, and it comes with two mags. 10 rounders and it is a hammer fired gun sights yeah a little bit to be desired but they say you know what i like it the security nine works fine other people said no way i would choose something that is a little smaller with greater capacity so as consistent with many of these is this pistol still relevant series people are pretty much split down the middle today we're going to feature something a little different now here are two ruger Wranglers chambered in 22 long rifle But actually I did not Tell the truth there. This one here is a diamondback sidekick. It looks like a Ruger Wrangler both are cowboy action Except for the Wranglers a little more cowboy action. It has a 4.62 inch barrel It's also budget priced at $269 270 essentially. It's a six shot Cowboy Action 22 Long Rifle Revolver. All right, and we can see that it's unloaded there. All right, as as we rotate the cylinder, I guess I wasn't, but anyhow, there it is. Nice little plinker, gets the job done. Nice training tool for people who are getting into the shooting sports. All right, or just to take down some small game, rabbits and squirrels, that's about it. But the reason I ask, is the Ruger Wrangler still relevant? We look at something like this. Here we have the Diamondback Sidekick. Now, the MSRP on this is 320, so it's about 50 bucks more, but what you get is a 22 long rifle cylinder and a 22 Magnum cylinder. And it is a swing out cylinder. But the greatest difference is the capacity. Here we have nine round capacity as with the Wrangler is six round capacity. So I guess I'm going with the same concept that I did when I spoke about the Security 9 Compact. Is that capacity of three rounds a deal breaker for you? Is the 50 bucks better spent with the Diamondback Sidekick with two cylinders and the option to shoot 22 Magnum or 22 Long Rifle with nine rounds in each with a, with a swing out cylinder versus the Cowboy Action where you have the loading gate and the arm here that ejects the shells, okay, or the cases, all right. Uh, this is more of a true Cowboy Action compared to the Sidekick, but for the flexibility that this offers with 22 magnum and 22 long rifle at 50 bucks more which has essentially the same profile when i originally said these were two ruger wranglers i have to believe not many people question that now the barrel's a little bit shorter four and a half inches 4.62 inches it goes 50 bucks more this is 50 bucks less this has a very nice Cerakote, and they now make this with a bird's head grip. They make it with a three and a half inch barrel. They make it with a 6.5 inch barrel, and they make it with a 7.5 inch barrel. So Ruger did expand the Wrangler line quite a bit, but they kept it with 22 long rifle. And I know there's a huge fan base out there for 22 Magnum. So is the Ruger Wrangler 
still relevant considering many others, and I mean many, not just the Diamondback sidekick. You look at Charter Arms Pathfinder series, many of those are eight round cylinder capacity. Is it a better choice or are you happy with the cowboy action, single action, 22 long rifle revolver with only six rounds? That is the question today. And once again, I look forward to hearing your feedback as to whether the Ruger Wrangler is still relevant or are there better choices out there. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.